in the first box. We're going to do vertical lines, starting from the top all the way to the bottom. So I'm going to start right next to this edge and just go like this, making sure none of my lines touch. I'm going to try and keep my lines nice and straight. All right, so those are vertical. Next up, we have horizontal. Horizontal goes from this side all the way to this side. So I'm going to start here at the top and go whoop, 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 whoop. Horizontal. And the last one is called diagonal. Looks kind of like a slide, like this. So I'm just going to go whoop, 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 whoop. And I have my different line directions. We have vertical, horizontal, and diagonal. Now I can add an AB pattern into each. So I'm going to do this one first. And I'm going to paint it purple and blue. So I'm going to do all my purples first, making sure to leave a white spot in between for my blue. The core of my AB pattern here is purple and blue. All right, check for white spots. There's my first pattern. I'm going to slide it over, and now I'm going to do my next pattern, my horizontal pattern. I'm going to pick two different colors. I'm going to do orange and yellow. Check for white spots. And my last one is my diagonal. Looks kind of like a slide. I'm going to do red and green for this one. All right, it's all done, and it needs to dry. So you're going to slide it above your mat, and then you can work on your warm-up. 